sure about this. As the man pulls over on a dirt road, the anchor, Shepard Smith, sounds wary. This makes me a little nervous, I gotta tell you. The suspect on foot now runs and stumbles, gun in hand. I guess it's always possible a guy could be on something. At this point, we're gonna pause the video as the man ends his own life. On Fox, however, they did not cut away on time. Get off it, get off it, get off it! My name is Doug. After a hastily run commercial break and on air apology. And we really messed up. And we're all very sorry. That didn't belong on TV. It was a particularly disastrous ending to what has become near daily fodder for cable and local news. From the O.J. Simpson slow speed chase to the toddler bounced out of a moving SUV. Police officials say live coverage of high speed chases is downright dangerous. These recent shots of bank robbers throwing cash out of a moving vehicle in L.A. sent viewers flooding into the street. You don't have to show it while it's live. Show it later. If you think there's some value to it, there's just as much value ten on a 10-minute delay as there is seeing it live. Broadcasters push back that live coverage provides real-time safety information. Running stop signs, running red lights. And what's more, viewers want to watch these scenes, which is why this classic American spectacle is not likely to disappear from the airwaves anytime soon. Dan Harris, ABC News, New York.